All right, guys, so rise and shine. And as you can see, it's early in the morning and everyone's heading out to find their spot on the bay because it's too windy to go outside. to another voyage of the Titanic. Just don't sink. They're gonna go try to fish something. Maybe the mangroves or something. We'll see, we'll see if they get lucky. So like you see, everybody's scattered around the island. So everybody just hanging out. Like us. Let's go enjoy out fishing. Mama and Gabby are sleeping, and I'm out here hanging out on the boat, just sightseeing, catching the breeze because it's windy today. But as long as I'm out here, it's all good for me. But yeah, just enjoying the day here, uh, doing the best you can because you can't go to the sandbar, you can't go to the islands, so and you can't tie up. So you know, you gotta hang out with yourself and wave hi to your friends. That's all you can do. But. Like I always say, better on the water than home, right? Well, on the weekends. What's up, man? What's up, Fresco? What's up, what's up? Chilling, man. Beautiful day. Yo, to be out here. Yes, Lucky man. you guys got the skis. Yes, <laughs> it's always cool when people come by that watch the channel and say hi and love the water as much as we do. You know what? It's 10.30 in the morning. It's time to get Big Mama and Gabby up because it's taking too long and I'm hungry. So let's wake him up. Look, oh, I thought you were sleeping. Look at Yuli sleeping, Gabby sleeping. We're playing on her phone and Big Mama getting did it up. It comes up. Big mama, what, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What? Ooh, look at that sexy baby suit. You go, girl. Want some sunblock? All right, so we got Master Chef, Big Mama in La Raza. What you, what you making? Some gourmet stuff? Mm -hmm. Oh, hold up, let me, let me see something. Let me see that cool hat you got. Wow, look at that cool hat, guys. If you like that, you can get it at frescochannel.com, baby. A little promo, you know, you gotta do it. So we got our own skillet, electric skillet, and then we'll see how it goes. And then she's trying out some new things. I don't even know what, what that is. Can you explain what are you doing? Hey, I do not know how to pronounce that. Uh, Pita bread or whatever it's called? This, no, it's this uh, nine rounds. Nine. Okay, some kind of pita bread, I guess we'll call it. And we make some eggs. And thanks again for the icing glass. It's so windy that the egg was getting everywhere. So we had to cut it out. Let me try the cheese. I'm the food inspector. It's like cheddar. It's cheddar cheese. All right, so we'll keep you guys in tune. And the kids, check this out. They must have smelled the food. And they came right on time. They just came back from the kayak. And they're going to go ahead and, I guess, join us for breakfast. Because they're hungry like me. Woo. And yeah. It's uh, you guys are gonna get a before and after of how many boats are gathering up around us. seen an egg wave here it is an egg wave it's it's so windy it's shaking the eggs around what you making actually making an egg wave instead of a we're actually making a 
making, trying to make him some scrambled eggs. But... Trying to make wavy scrambled eggs because it's so windy that the boat's getting shifted. The wave is looking a little better. I guess it must be the cook, right? Check so I guess this Check is a multi-function skillet. It uh, toasts, it fries, it does scrambles. So this is the million dollar breakfast. It's a little messy because I Because of the view. Look at the view. We're in the center of the bay. <laughs> All right, guys. The million dollar breakfast right here. Really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like it. Really good. It's big mama I did or so. And by the way, thank you to those who bought merchandise and help support the channel and look good too. And by the way, Sandbar Life has been a brand that has taken off because it describes a style and a way of life we live for those who love the water as much as we do. And like you can see, it's completely different from last year, but we still enjoyed it because we got to hang out with our friends and met new ones. Gabby's out of the cabin, look guys. Gabby's out of the cabin. Look, first time in 10 years he's out of the cabin. And talking about friends, Carlos and Marie showed up. We have been friends for a very long time and we used to boat together back when I used to have my 39 foot Sonic. And they showed up in this beautiful and tripping that I had to go see. Look, he stole my boat, look, he stole it. It was nice to see them again and catch up with the old times. And I got to see this beautiful and trip. Well, as you can see, for the situation we're in, plus the weather, everything is turning out pretty good so far. What time is it? What time is it? It's dinner time. But it's a simple, quick tuna. Sorry about the music in the background because you know we had that, we had that, we had the place, Miami style. Got music bumping everywhere. Yep, yep, yep. Using that skillet one more time. I look at you, you're waiting for his pain. You're looking now. It's my turn. Hey, my turn. I want one. Okay, I'm gonna get All right, guys. Once again, saved by what? Yep, the icing glass. Cause it's raining. The usual crazy. Miami weather over here. Hey, look, everybody's getting wet, except for us. Except for us, see, everybody's getting wet. Well, yep, that's a Miami weather for you. Beautiful and sunny, and then it gets crazy in two seconds. So, thank you for the icing glass once again. We're just chilling. Like, I don't know if you guys can see the weather, it's coming, boy. It's coming down there. Crazy Miami weather. 
Well, if you guys remember from the previous video, I said we changed our plans from going to Fort Myers due to the bad weather forecast that I thought it was wrong because like you saw, the day turned out to be beautiful. But towards the late afternoon, we started to get hit with rain and I noticed that it was getting worse and the forecast said that it was gonna rain Sunday and Monday. So we decided to cut our plans short because we were planning to stay the whole weekend. But I guess it wasn't gonna work out. So we decided to pick up and get going. And we had to hurry up because like you can see, the rain is coming right behind us. But feeling good that we got to enjoy at least two days out on the boat. And the kids got to enjoy the kayak that they went fishing, but they didn't catch anything. But at least they had fun. And remember, if you like water activities and family fun, Miami style, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to watch more videos like this, check them out on our video section of our channel.